Diatoms are microscopic algae, but their importance is planetary in scale. They are recognized by their unique cell walls made of silica, called frustules. These frustules form intricate, symmetrical patterns, and under the microscope they look like tiny pieces of glass art. But diatoms are not just beautiful, they are also vital for life on Earth. Today, diatoms are responsible for producing more than 20% of the oxygen in our atmosphere. That means every fifth breath we take is connected to these single-celled organisms. But oxygen is only one part of their importance. Diatoms are also food. They form the base of aquatic food webs. Tiny protozoa, microscopic zooplankton, and filter-feeding invertebrates graze on them. These in turn are eaten by fish, seabirds, and even whales. Without diatoms, marine life as we know it would collapse. From an evolutionary perspective, diatoms are relatively new compared to bacteria or cyanobacteria. Their fossil record begins in the early Jurassic, around 180 million years ago. But their true diversification came later, during the Cretaceous and into the Tertiary, when their diversity and abundance exploded, transforming ocean productivity. This rise of diatoms is often called a quiet revolution in Earth's history, shaping modern marine ecosystems, their silica walls also make them excellent fossils. Unlike many soft-bodied microorganisms, diatoms leave behind durable glass-like shells in sediments. Fossil diatoms from the Oligocene and other periods are preserved in great detail, and scientists use them to reconstruct ancient environments and track climate change over millions of years. The bottom line is that diatoms are not just microscopic algae. They produce oxygen, they feed life from protozoa to whales, and they have left behind a fossil record that reveals the deep history of our planet. Their delicate glass walls remind us of their beauty, while their ecological and evolutionary roles show us that even at the microscopic level, life has the power to shape Earth's history.